Michael Landon. Yes. Because you have nothing but good things to say about that man. You know, he was like Santa Claus and God wrapped in one when we were on Little House of the Prairie. I mean, he was this larger-than-life figure that made every day so exciting. Um, he drove all of the energy on that set. But what was really amazing about him was he was an incredible businessman way before his time. I mean, he was someone who really understood the business of Hollywood. Rather than just being the star up front, he owned the show, he wrote the show, he cre created it, he directed did it. He kept all the revenue for himself. And on the set, he knew how to run a profitable business. I mean, Hollywood is very much controlled by the Teamsters. He made friends with the union. He gave them lavish Christmas presents, usually at NBC's expense. And he got them on his side, you know, to the point where when he did need to do overtime, they would do it quickly and quietly, you know, without fining him or charging him extra. He had, all, the thing ran like a fine oiled machine. You know, for all the kids, he really treated us like, you were being paid an adult wage, you need to work like an adult. Everybody show up every day on time, lines learned, hit your mark. This is a serious job. And there was pride in the job well done. You liked that approach. I did. I mean, I think it, it, it was another thing that really set me up for life. This idea that the pride in a job well done, you know, when you're working together as a group and you achieve something well. I, I was having dinner with Melissa Gilbert not too long ago, and she said she thinks this is why none of the kids in Little House on the Prairie ended up in rehab. Yeah, because, yeah. because you know, the child actors yeah. don't have a great history of yeah. turning out well. I, it's very, I can say that. It's absolutely true. And, and and for him, it was a very different set. There were no divas. There were no trailers. There were no princesses. You know, he said, we everyone is here. Everyone is equal. Everyone is working. Everyone is doing a job. We work together. We get it done. We bring something to the table. And then we celebrate afterwards. And he demanded a lot of the kids. And then there was fun afterwards. And there was reward. And they really had it down to a science because there were so many kids on the set. We had a blast. You know, we'd have birthday parties. We would play together. The crew really indulged us. But we were there for a job, and then we were rewarded when it was done, and it was an, an interesting college to go to at a very young age, and I, I write all about that in, in uh, Diary of a Stage Mother's Daughter, a lot of the fans of Little House of Prairie, and people that are just interested in the mechanics of how the business works have liked that. I'm fascinated by that.